I have often seen people associate nuclear energy, the simple production of electricity, with weapons of mass destruction. In other words, there are a number of people that believe that having nuclear energy is equivalent to having nuclear weapons or dropping nuclear bombs on people, something like that. Here's an example right here where you can see that this person is arguing against using nuclear energy because of what happened at Hiroshima and Nagasaki. And you can do that if you want, but then you're associating two completely different things. That's like saying, I don't want commercial aircraft because the military uses those to drop bombs and shoot missiles and so forth. And I hope it's obvious that military application of technology is nowhere near the same thing as civilian application of technology, unless you're talking about rudimentary things like using cell phones. And I, I guess you could even oppose use of cell phones because the military uses those to kill people. Uh, but uh, that's something that probably is just due to the birth defect of nuclear energy and that when we first developed the commercial nuclear reactors, that came from the technology that came out of the military. So the development of technology for the military did help civilian applications in giving us nuclear energy where you have an environmentally friendly source that's greenhouse gas free that's incredibly safe and that would be commercial nuclear energy for civil production of electricity. So I uh, hope that uh, taught everybody something. We all enjoyed the video and have a fantastic day.